From time to time, your teachers may ask you to use uh, email to send them something, or you mean to need to email something to another student um, for a project or something you're working on. So there's a couple different ways to get into email, uh, but one that probably works the best is one called uh, the Gmail app. And so I have my Gmail app down here in the dock. It's the one with the uh, red M. And when I tap on that, it asks me to sign in if I haven't done so already. So when I click sign in, I'm gonna log in with my Google account. All right, it may automatically fill in your name. All right, our, my email address. Remember, it is your username that's on the sticker at student.psdr3.org. And then type in uh, your password. So once I'm set up, this is what my uh, email looks like. It puts all of my messages in here. There's a little pencil button down at the bottom. And when I tap the pencil, this is what opens up a new message and allows me to compose an email. So in the to field, I could type in uh, a student or teacher's name. And when I type it in, it's going to show me anyone that matches that. I simply tap on the one I want to add their name. If I needed to do a carbon copy, there's a little triangle on the right hand side here that I can add a carbon copy if I need to uh, notify other people about this email. I need to make sure I click and give my email a subject. I type in my message, and then when I'm done, I'm simply going to click the uh, arrow key in the upper right hand corner uh, in order to send that uh, message away. Right, when I receive an email from somebody, then all I have to do is simply tap on that message, and I'll be able to read that message. All right, and then once reading on that message, in the upper right hand corner of that message, there are three dots. And if I tap on these three dots, it gives me the ability to reply to this message, to forward this message to somebody else or print. So if I needed to reply, I would tap reply. It will automatically add the recipient and the subject in here. I simply type in my message and then he used the same uh, arrow to send it when I'm done. Now, another cool thing I can do with email is if I go to an app like Safari, for example, I have my share arrow in the upper right hand corner up here. And when I tap on that, it gives me some share options. But in this middle line, if I go all the way to the right, there's an option here called more. And if I hit more, this will show me some other sharing options that I can turn on. And one of these options is one called Gmail. What this will do is this makes the Gmail option uh, a sharing option. So with my Gmail share option turned on, if I am going to any website and I wanted to share this website with somebody else, I can tap on my share arrow now and I can choose and tap on Gmail and it will automatically open up a mail window that allows me to type in who I want this to go to, choose their name from the list, uh, my address is in there. I can go ahead and type in my message, but it automatically takes that link and adds it to a message for me. I type in my message and I hit send, and then that is shared or sent, emailed directly to uh, that person. So it's a, a short, quick way uh, to send a link or something. Uh, any, pretty much any app that has a share button uh, gives me options to be able to do that directly from uh, the share up here and Gmail.